بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وسلم اور لسن تدي وار توكينج اباوت سيميلارتي سيميلارتي اف يو تيك ا فوتو فور يو وذ ا كاميرا ذن ذير فوتو ابيرس اون ذا سكرين از مينيمايزيشن ان ذيس كيس اتس كلير ذات يور فوتو از سيميلار تو يو But the the size of photo not size of, to you. The height of the photo it's not height of you. Then we can say the photo similar to you. The similarity of the two polygons. It's said to the polygons for the same number of sides are similar if the following two conditions: number one. The two, the the their corresponding angles are equal in measure, and corresponding sides are proportional. The most corresponding angles are equal in measure, but sides proportional. Proportion it mean have the same ratio. For example, if we have two polygons, A, B, C, and D, and another polygon X, Y, Z, and L, and measure of angle A equal measure of angle X. Measure of angle B equal measure of angle Y. Measure of angle C equal measure of angle Z. And the measure of angle D equal measure of angle L. Here is the corresponding angles. The first A equal the first X. Second angle B equal second angle Y. Third angle C equal third angle Z. And the fourth angle D equal the fourth angle L. Here it means the corresponding angles are equal in measure. What about sides? The length of AB over XY equal BC over YZ equal CD over ZL equal DA over LX. Uh, it's mean the all ratios are equal. It's mean proportional. Then the lengths of the correspond corresponding sides are proportional. Here the first conditions, all angles, uh, corresponding angles are equal in measure. And the corresponding sides are proportional, then we can set to be A, B, C, D are similar. X, Y, Z, L similar, denoted by this uh, symbol. A, B, C, D are similar. X, Y, Z, L. Uh, if the constant constant, it means the ratio between corresponding sides. It means the factor. Number one, if the ratio greater than one, then the polygon P1 is enlargement to the polygon P2. If the ratio or the proportional or the ratio greater than one, then the first polygon is enlargement to the second polygon. If the ratio less than one, then the first polygon is minimization of the second polygon. If the ratio equal one, then the, the two polygons are congruent. This is the three cases. Number one, if the ratio data is on one, it means the first polygon enlargement to the second polygon. If the ratio is then one, it means the first polygon is minimization to the second polygon. If the ratio equals one, it means the two polygons are uh, congruent. <clears throat> to find the two polygons are uh, similar, uh, we must the two conditions together. For example, the rectangle and the square. Here. All sides in all angles in square, it's measure it's measure equal 90 degree. Each angle in the square, it's measure equal 90 degree, and each angle in the rectangle, it's measure equal 90 degree. So the corresponding angles are equal in measure, but the sides are not proportional. So we can't say the square similar rectangle. The square and the rectangle are not similar because the corresponding sides not proportional. What about square and rhombus? All sides are equal in square and all sides are equal in rhombus, so the corresponding sides are proportional. For example, if it was a square, each side equal five centimeters, and we have 
uh, the rhombus each side equals six, uh, five centimeter. So the ratio between corresponding sides four to five, four to five, four to five, four to five. Here the corresponding sides are proportional, but the angles doesn't equal. So the square and uh, rhombus are not similar uh, polygons. So to to see it, to be that two polygons are similar, they must the two conditions are satisfied. All regular polygons of the same number of sides are similar, like square. All squares are similar. All equilateral triangles are similar. All regular hexagons are similar. All the polygons of the same number of sides are uh, similar. For example, all squares are similar. All uh, equilateral triangles are similar, or regular hexagon are similar, and so on. <coughs> the congruent polygons are similar, but it's not necessary that the similar polygons are congruent. If we have two congruent polygons, then they are similar. But if we have two similar polygons, it's not necessary. The, they are congruent. For example, if we have two polygons are congruent, each sides are equals, corresponding sides are equal, and each side is equal three centimeter, then the other polygon, the side equals three centimeter, then the ratio between any two corresponding sides equals three over three equals one. So, if the two polygons are congruent, then they are similar. But if they are similar, similar we, the corresponding sides are proportional. If the corresponding sides are equal, then they are congruent. If each of the two polygons is similar to the third polygon, then they are similar. If we have three polygons, H two polygons similar to third, then they are similar. If H two polygons is similar to the third polygons, then they are similar. If we write the first polygon A B C D is similar to the second polygon X Y Z L, then we did uh, use directly the corresponding sides are proportional and the corresponding sides are equal then a b over x y equal b c here the order it's necessary here the a first x is the first b second y second c third and so on then a b first and second over x y first and second point b c second and third vertices over y z c d over ZL, AD over XL are corresponding uh, sides. And the corresponding angles, A equal X, B equal Y, and C equal Z, and the D equals L. The ratio between the perimeter of the two similar polygons equals the ratio between the lengths of two corresponding sides. For example, if we have two similar polygons, the ratio between corresponding sides 1 over 2 then the ratio between uh, uh, the perimeter of two similar polygons equal 1 over 2. Then the ratio between the perimeter of two similar polygons equal the ratio between the lengths of two corresponding sides. In the opposite <coughs> figure, the polygon A, B, C, D are similar to the polygon X, Y, Z, L. A, B equal 10.5, B, C equal 8, C, D equals 5, D, A equal 6 cm, and X, L equal 3 cm. Then find the length of X, Y, and Y, Z, and Z, L. Here the two polygons are similar. We want to find the length of the sides. We write the corresponding uh, proportion, sides. Then we write A, B over X, Y equal B, C over 
واي زد ايكوال سي دي اوفر زد ال ايكوال اي دي اوفر اكس ال اي بي اوفر واي اكس بي سي اوفر واي زد سي دي اوفر زد ال دي اي اوفر ال اكس اند سبستيوشن باي ذا لينس سو 10.5 اوفر واي اكس واي equal 8 over y z equal 5 over z l equal 6 over 3 here the complete ratio d a over l x equal 6 over 3 then we can write x y equals 3 times 10.5 over 6 equal uh, 5.25 and y z equals 8 times 3 over uh, 6 equal 4 centimeter ZL equal 5 times 3 over 6 equal 2.5 centimeter if uh, the two polygons are similar we write the corresponding sides or the proportion of the corresponding sides at the order AB over XY equal BC over YZ equal CD over ZL equal DA over LX and substitution by the length of the values. Another example in the opposite figure ABCD are similar XYZL uh, calculate measure of angle BCD and the length of find the length of XL uh, number three if the parameter of a b c d is 26 find the parameter of x y z l first a b c d are similar x y z l so measure of angle d equal measure of angle l then measure of angle d equal 80 degree because angle l equal 80 degree A, B, C, D is a quadrilateral. The sum of all interior angles of quadrilateral equals 360 degree. Here we, we have angle A and angle B and angle D. We want to find the measure of angle C. Then measure of angle C equals 360 minus the sum of three angles. We can write measure of angle C equals 360 minus the sum of a plus B plus D 125 plus 70 plus 80 it will be 85 then measure of angle C equals 85 and the measure of angle Z equals 85 degree find the length of XL <coughs> now we write the proportional corresponding sides between the proportional sides then A D over XL equal BC over YZ AD equal 6 centimeter BC equal 8 centimeter YZ equal 2.4 centimeter then we find LX equal 6 time 2.4 divided by 8 equals 1.8 Another example, number three, uh, if the parameter of A, B, C, D equal 26, what is the parameter of X, Y, L, Z? The ratio between two sides, 8 over 2.4. 8 over 2.4. Then the parameter of the figure A, B, C, D over the parameter of X, Y, Z, L equal 10 over uh, 3. Then 26 over the parameter of X, Y, Z, L equal 10 divided by 3. Then the parameter equals 3 times 26 divided by 10 uh, equal 7.2. Uh, this is the simplest lesson on similarity. We know the similarity of the two polygons. Uh, we must uh, have the two conditions 
number one corresponding angles are equal in measure and the corresponding sides are uh, proportional if the ratio between the two corresponding sides greater than one then uh, the first polygon is enlarged in second polygon if the ratio less than one then the first polygon is minimization uh, of the second ratio if the ratio between two corresponding sides equal one then the two polygons are uh, congruent second lesson we are talking about similarity in the triangle thank you and the good boy